new boss fight and some mystical and crystal summoning action up ahead, so stay tuned. Hey, what's up guys? Triple Ben Gaming here. Just want to say welcome. If you're new to this series, make sure to check the previous parts. I'll put a playlist link uh, somewhere on the screen uh, right now. And otherwise, welcome back. And just sending some love to my friends in the game. If you want to add me, my nickname is going to appear in a second. There you go. So my nickname is right on the top left of your screen. So you guys are more than welcome to add me in the game and use my monsters to help you out. Time to make a wish! What are we gonna get? Been getting some pretty crappy prizes recently. Hopefully this time it's gonna be different. 10,000 mana stones. Not too shabby, not too shabby. Alright, so right now I'm just gonna increase my monster slots. Because I wanna use some of the social summon points. And I want to ask you guys uh, playing the game, what is your monster slot number? Like, uh, what is a good monster slot number? Right now I'm at 45 slots. I'm not sure if that's too much or too little. Let me know in the comment section. Appreciate it. And we're not really summoning anything special so far. But that's okay, because later in this video we're going to be using some of the crystal and mystical. Uh, scrolls so I'm looking forward to that pretty excited you guys stick around oh a fire war bear that's nice all right we're done so let's go ahead and go to the Tamar desert to finish up the quest there I'm at the boss level I haven't fought him yet I think it's a wind monster, but I'm not sure. Let's go ahead and check that out. Yep, it's a wind monster, so... Three fire monsters and... Uh, yeah, one water monster there just for the heck of it. <laughs> so I'm just gonna take a quick second to thank you guys for all the likes, comments and support you showed me. It keeps me going, so keep them coming. And much love to all of ya. Alright, so first wave, plenty of wind monster opponents. We have plenty of fire monsters, so this should pause no problems whatsoever. There you go. The fire fairy doing an excellent job. Vampire as well. His attacks are pretty uh, powerful. And that's some vampire power for you right there. One left, few more attacks, there you go. And here we are at the second wave, which should be pretty easy and straightforward. Fire against wind, that's element 101 for you right there. Although I doubt Succubus is gonna make it, she's a water monster. Yeah, there you go. Can't take much heat from a wind monster. That's okay, three against three. I like those odds with the... Us using fire. Go get them, Tantra. Good work, vampire. Good work. Keep it up. One left. I think this one's gonna make it. Boom! And here we are against the boss of the desert. So once again, he has two fire sidekicks. Uh, fire against fire doesn't do much. So we're just gonna focus on him and ignore the sidekicks. We're halfway there, but he just regenerated. It's like he almost hurt me or something. I'm not gonna creep myself out just yet. Stay focused, Ben, stay focused. All right, we took him down again to halfway but this time we only have two monsters left but I'm not too worried because we got Tantra he is one hell of a tank he can take some damage all right 
And we're close, guys. We're very close. Can we do this? Let's do this. Few more hits. Oh, no. Are you kidding me? All right. We're not going to back off just yet. And I think once we take off the last remaining sidekick, he just can't regenerate his health. I think this time is the right one. Yeah. Victory. Woo. It sure tastes sweet. And we got a rune. Strong guard rune. I have not started using those yet. Let's go back. And home sweet home. An urgent message from Duran? Doesn't seem like it. Okay, so he's informing us that the council is under attack by some uh, evil summoners. This kind of reminds me of uh, fairy tale. I don't know if you guys are familiar with the Japanese anime fa fairy tale. It's by the same guys that made uh, One Piece. If you have not seen that, you should totally check it out. It's an excellent, excellent anime. And talking about anime, I wanted to ask you guys, what is your favorite animes? Mine would probably be a Dragon Ball and Ken the Survivor and probably Fairy Tale as a third one. Let me know in the comment section. Pretty curious. I'm a big anime fan, big manga fan. Alright guys, so I'm just gonna show you real quick this new area I just got. This you can only buy with glory points that you can earn fighting uh, other players in the arena. And this this area actually, um, you can put monsters in there and they will just level keep leveling up. So it's pretty nice. Ooh, who's this? Morgana? She looks pretty, doesn't she? Alright, so seems like we have a new rival and we're gonna go straight ahead and challenge her for some uh, crystals. <laughs> but most importantly for the glory, right guys? Because that's what we aim for. <laughs> Here we go. The fifth and new rival, Morgana. Let's check out her monsters. She seems to be using a lot of water monsters. So... Just gonna use uh, some wind monsters. With one fire to fight her Garuda. So fun fact guys, I just came back from my trip. I went to Bali in Indonesia and there I saw uh, an airline called Garuda which Garuda is uh, actually a mythical bird from the Hindu and Buddhist uh, mythology. So I just thought I would mention that. By the way, Bali is pretty awesome. If you guys have a chance to visit it, make sure to go there because you're going to have a blast. It's an awesome, awesome island. And back to the game. So I'll use the vampire mainly to attack the, the Garuda bird. And the wind, my, my wind monsters to attack his or her um, water monsters. And the strategy seems to be working pretty well so far. Almost got rid of her water yeti. Let's take him down right now. Boom. Four against two. I'll take those odds every day of the week. Go ahead with that uh, wind shot. Pretty nice. And the battle is almost over. One more hit. Go for it. Wind fairy. There you go. Victory. Our victory in our first 
new rival match. Morgana, don't be mad at us. All right. I'm just going to check real quick the next area. That's going to be in the next part, part 8. Yes, I am a curious cat. All right, Inferno. Never seen that before. Looks tough. And Werewolf. All right, and it is time. The time that you and I have been looking forward, have been excited about. It's time to use and to summon some mystical and crystal scrolls. But first things first, let's uh, clear some space in my monster slots. As you can see, I have none. And I'm going to use some to power up maybe... Let's see. Maybe the wind bear? Yeah, let's, let's power up the wind bear. And by the way, guys, if you like this game and my videos, make sure to leave me a comment in the comment section. I always love to hear from you and interact with you. And I look forward to that. So, yeah. And we're ready for some power-up action. And done. Eh, we gained one level. But we freed five slots, so let's go and start with uh, su with summoning Inugami, which is I got him from um, from the secret dungeon. Ooh, looking pretty badass. So I got I collected the 40 pieces required. I believe that was last weekend. And let's go ahead and uh, use some crystals now. What are we gonna get? Pretty exciting. What? This is not funny. <laughs> Such a bad luck. But anyways, let's go ahead and uh, try again. Maybe this time we're gonna hit the jackpot. A five-star monster. Looks like a wind uh, hellhound. Ooh, and it's an awakened three-star hellhound. So I'll take that and time for a mystical summoning. Hmm. Nice. That's a four star Kung Fu girl. What do you guys think of this one? Looks pretty good. I'll check the user ratings later. And that is it guys for this video. I hope you enjoyed it. And if you did, please give it a thumbs up and let me know in the comment section. You can also check out some of my other videos on my channel. I'd love to have you subscribe as well. And until next time, keep playing.